Adam, not a debut to remember. It wasn't a great spectacle, and Harrogate have somehow left with a three-goal victory. What's your analysis of what's gone on this afternoon? Um, disappointing, very disappointing. Um, even though we didn't play great at all, and that's, well, that's an understatement. To be fair, even though we didn't play well at all and didn't get going, I don't feel, I don't think the keepers had a save to make really, and they've ended up scoring three goals. So it's uh, it's something that needs working on, and something. The manager and the boys have all said in there we are going to work on it and we realise where we're at and everyone seems to be on the same page and we're going to we're going to have to now come together and put it right because we need wins quickly. It's not been characteristic of Adam's team so far. Bad defending. He's really tightened it up and it's been pretty much one goal a game. But today just, the se- the second goal in particular, just a catalogue of errors. Yeah, he's just said that in there. Obviously, I can't really comment on that because obviously I'm not so much being here. But he has just said that in there that it's. He doesn't mind losing as long as you lose in the right way. And uh, and the defensive what? side of it is nice and solid, but obviously today that wasn't the right way to lose a football match. And a couple of the, I think they're all poor goals to be fair. So And then on the flip side, Ben Gordon hit the post with a free kick, but apart yeah. from that I don't I think he really had a chance. No, we d- we didn't get to go, we didn't get in any ri- at I didn't feel there was any rhythm at all in the game today. I mean that was not just me personally, I think everyone felt that. I think it wasn't so much that the effort wasn't there, it was just the, the rhythm and no, we couldn't really get going, we were, we were playing balls into areas that we didn't work on and we didn't want and that was causing a knock on effect on affecting us defensively and we got too open and that's just how they, and they came to ruin the game, they came to slow the game down and we played into their hands really basically. How big a factor, probably the main factor, is it Adam Murray and you joining Boston United? Yeah, pretty much the main one, um, I'm not, I know him very well. Uh, even as a player before as a manager but obviously as a manager as well recently working with him and he's, I think he's unbelievable I think that if if the uh, well I'm, I'm sure I don't mean if but I'm sure that when he gets the time and if as long as everyone gives, gives him the patience of letting him get his ideas across this this football club will get taken on to the next level I can guarantee that pretty much and uh, it's just as long as he gets that time and I mean he knows that he hasn't got complete time at the minute he needs results and He's not got his proper stamp on this team yet, but he knows that and he knows that we're in a position now where it doesn't really matter what the performance is like to a certain extent, we need victories, but I mean, over the long term he will be a very, very good manager for his football club. And your move could have potentially happened at Christmas time, you obviously ended up then playing in the two games against Boston over Christmas, why was the time right now at the end of January to, to make the move? Well, it was just... At the time the first approach came, it was just before Christmas and my wife had just started working nights again uh, as, a, as if, obviously I'd come out of full-time football. We've got a little boy and he's not in full-time school and he's only at, he's only at school till 12 and it was coming up to Christmas and it was just the travel because I don't drive. It, it was just, there was a lot of factors that sort of made it, made it hard work for me and I didn't want to come to a place not fully not fully focused, not fully committed, not fully ready. And obviously I'd only just been at games for a short while and they showed faith in me and they gave me the opportunity. So I felt a little bit of, maybe not loyalty, but I showed, I showed a little bit of, I thought, I thought I needed to just give them a, give them something and they were good for me and I did enjoy it. I don't regret it at all, but it was just at the time. There was nothing to do. There wasn't a reflection on the football club or my thoughts on coming here or what I thought of how they were as a club or where they were going, it was just purely my family.